During the summer and fall seasons, the Gulf Coast and eastern seaboard of the United States are on guard to the threat of tropical cyclones. The goal of meteorologists is to protect life and property, and one way this can be accomplished is by teaching and preparing citizens what they can expect and how to prepare if you are threatened by a tropical cyclone. A tropical cyclone is a rotating low-pressure weather system that has organized thunderstorm activity not associated with a front. NOAA's National Hurricane Center predicts and tracks these storm systems throughout the Atlantic Basin. Hurricane season begins on June 1st and ends on November 30th. The average peak of hurricane season takes place around September 10th, and a typical season averages around 12 storms. The main parts of a tropical cyclone, especially hurricanes, are the rain bands, the eye, and the eye wall. Air spirals in toward the center in a counterclockwise pattern in the northern hemisphere, clockwise in the southern hemisphere, and out the top in the opposite direction. The eye is a relatively calm and mostly cloud-free area of sinking air and light winds. The eye wall consists of a ring of tall thunderstorms that produce heavy rains and usually the strongest winds. Rain bands are curved bands of clouds and thunderstorms that trail away from the eye wall in a spiral fashion. These bands are capable of producing heavy bursts of rain and wind, as well as tornadoes. A tropical cyclone's greatest impacts often occur in the right front quadrant of the system relative to the storm's motion.